Hey everyone, Christopher here from Themeco. Today I'm going to show you guys how to add an inline search capability into your mobile menu. So if you have a website that has a mobile menu, this uh, header should use as the navigation collapsed element in the header builder and the final result should be something like this. So normally you would have the menus of the mobile menu items, but we added an additional search inline inside the off canvas section of the um, navigation collapse element. So let's get started and see how we would create such a feature in our pro header. Okay, to start the work, we are going to go to the header builder of the pro theme by going to pro headers. And then I'm going to add a new header and I'm going to use the template. Uh, I already went to pro design cloud and added, installed the uh, design cloud header called top hat security, which is the header that I used uh, in this video. So top hat security here, and then I add a name. So mobile inline search, maybe. Okay, created. So the header is created. I click on the header and just set it to show on the front end of the website in the front page so I can have a look at it and then click edit button to access the header builder. I'm going to check the front end by clicking this icon at the left side of the screen to see the results. Okay, here's the desktop mode. I right click on the Chrome, develop, uh, Chrome browser and select the inspect menu item to open up the developer toolbar and I use the uh, device toolbar here, uh, the responsive toolbar to make sure that I can just make the width of the uh, website smaller so the mobile menu comes up. If I click on the mobile menu at the moment you do not see the inline search and it is a normal uh, menu used on the header. If I go here and use the a responsive icon at the left uh, section of the pro header builder I can just change the view to have a mobile menu view mobile view and then the mobile menu just comes up and I can select that and then go to the layout and you'll see that this is navigation collapse element that is used now how we are gonna add the inline search we're gonna add the inline search element, which is available in the pro header builder. And the next step will be to just detach that element and put it into the top of the inside menu items that are available in the navigation collapse. So let's do that. I add an element here, the inline search, the search inline element. And you can click the uh, magnifying glass icon to do whatever changes that you want to do for the view of the search inline. Here it is. The thing that I'm going to do is to go to customize tab of the search inline element and add a class. This will be the mobile source class, which is the source element that we are going to detach and we need uh, we need to have a point here and this class is a great way to select this element in the code that later we're going to add uh, in the header builder the next thing is that we are going to just attach or uh, just put the uh, search inline element into the navigation collapse so we need a way to select this navigation collapse I click the magnifying glass and again go to customize tab and add a class there so I add mobile destination destination 
okay and I'm gonna save the header and let's check the result in the front end of the website okay the search inline is available now if now I select uh, using the developer toolbar you're gonna see here that the class that I've talked about is already added this is mobile source class which is added into the search inline and if I select the uh, navigation collapse here it is the mobile destination class is added into the navigation collapse element so I have a way now to select these items using uh, JavaScript code I'm going to add uh, the code now here let me copy the code okay I'm gonna add the code into the JS option of the pro header builder at the left section of the screen I can add it into the theme options too in the pro theme options JS uh, option but uh, because this is something related to header only and it should be loaded whenever the header is loading I prefer to add it into the JS option of the uh, header itself so let's paste and make it a little bit bigger so you guys can see the code uh, the code is wrapped into the jQuery function so the first line and the last line is mandatory for any Java, uh, JavaScript jQuery library code that you would add into your website this is the way that you have no conflict with other JavaScript libraries the first um, line of code just selects the mobile source if you remember the mobile source class is added into search inline element so we select the search inline and by dot that you can see here before the mobile source it shows that we select the class and not the HTML ID ID is the pound sign or uh, hashtag and then you uh, gonna detach the element from the code and from the HTML code and the page uh, the way to do that is the detach function and we save the detached uh, element which is the search into a new variable called element now we're gonna use this element and attach it to the navigation collapse how we can select the navigation collapse we already have a class for that so the mobile destination is the class and we add a dot for the class but we do not want to add it into the wrapper because the wrapper of the element is here uh, th that you can see in the toggle but we want it to be added into the uh, off canvas section so I select the off canvas and open it up and uh, as you can see there is a UL element and then inside the UL is the uh, are the menus that are added so I need to add the search inline inside this tag which is the uh, UL tag uh, on ordered list and a distinct class that you can use is this x-menu-collapsed uh, class now if you see here I added x-menu-collapsed class and uh, the prepend function in jQuery just attach whatever you uh, select inside the function and we selected the element that we already have and this is how we just put out this uh, uh, section and add it into the um, navigation collapse element so let's check the result here refresh okay now you saw that the search inline just is gone and if you open up you're gonna see that search inline is already added into the uh, off canvas section of the menu but there is a problem if I reload the page you're gonna see that in a um, just uh, flicker like way the search inline is 
showing at the header and then the JavaScript uh, code kicks in and just uh, gets rid of the search inline. So uh, we need to get rid of this uh, flickering search inline at the uh, lo uh, first load of the page. To do that, we need to add a CSS code. Let me just copy that. I am going to add it into the CSS option of the Pro Header Builder. And uh, what uh, this is do is that uh, it is going to select the mobile source, which is the search inline again, but it will just hide it by displaying non-CSS code. It will hide only a mobile source element that is uh, just adjacent and inside the xbar container. xbar container is the class name of the bar element uh, of the container element that we have here. So uh, when you have uh, immediately a container and after that you have a search in line, you're gonna hide that. But whenever we just get the search element and put it inside the navigation collapse, uh, the uh, search inline uh, is no more in, uh, immediately is inside the container and it actually goes inside the navigation collapse. That is why the CSS code will only work at the beginning and after the JS code kicks in, it will show and it will not hide the search inline. Uh, this greater than sign uh, in CSS shows that uh, the child uh, class should be immediately available after the parent class. So I'm going to save this one and refresh the page and there should be no flickering effect anymore. And here it is. So it's loaded and it shows this search inline element. Now, uh, this is how you would do for the navigation collapse, but there are uh, other headers and elements that you would use and there are different navigation uh, elements that we have, various ones for the mobile menu. You can use the navigation model, navigation layered, and navigation dropdown. For all of them, you need to have a unique and different class in the JS uh, code, specifically when you want to select the off canvas. For example, uh, the um, navigation collapse uses the off canvas and this collapse one, but let's see for the model. For the model, you need to use this one. So the mobile destination is uh, the correct one, but the other uh, uh, class should be X menu model. This is for the navigation model, and for the navigation uh, drop down, you would use this one here X menu drop down. And finally, for the navigation layered, you're going to use X menu layered. So you just replace this, uh, replace this one with one of the uh, latter ones. I'm gonna add all the codes necessary for different navigation elements into the uh, description box. Okay guys, thank you everyone. And here's how we would add a search inline feature into one of the mobile navigation menu items.